Hey, how are you? So you're looking to tame some wolves. That's completely understandable. Having tamed wolves is pretty cool. Well, they are very, very difficult animals to deal with. They deal a lot of damage and are pretty quick. So trapping them is one hell of a trip. You won't have to worry about fixing walls or building pens because there's an easy way you can trick these guys into falling straight into your trap. Now, without further ado, let's get straight into this method. All right, just ran into some goblins and some wolves, had to deal with them real quick. But what I was going to say is you want to have a base of some sort because you'll want to be building close by to where your place of residence is for a reason I'll explain in just a moment. But what you're going to want to do is get your pickaxe, all right? Now this is how we're going to build a pen. You're simply just going to dig into the ground. It's as simple as that. All right, now I've dug a hole. It's pretty deep. If you dig into the walls right here, it should expand the walls because that's the way that the mining works in this game, apparently. There's a wolf down there. have to be careful he doesn't see me. Not yet, anyway. All right, so you're going to dig a hole about this size. It doesn't really matter. It could be as small or as big as you want. It just needs to be somewhat deep. All right, deep enough that nothing can run out except for us, of course, because we can climb walls. Now what you want to do next is place down a crafting bench, obviously. I recommend placing it down in here because the wolves love to attack it. You're then going to make a runway of some sort and I'll show you why in just a second. Alright, so I found this little buddy down here. Going to try and lure him. Let's run. Alright, you're going to want to pull out your hammer, get him onto that, and then drop him. Now, in case I was too quick, I jumped off this catwalk, and then I middle mouse clicked it to destroy it. And he has fallen straight into that hole. Now, he cannot get out. Not at all. He is definitely stuck there forever. Um, he's a one star as well, which is pretty nice. Now, all you need to do is, because I built this close to where I'm staying... Uh, he will be within render distance, meaning he he will tame while as long as I'm in my base or in my home. If I go somewhere else, I go through a portal, or I go off to do something, it will um it'll stop. He, he'll stop taming. It'll freeze in time. He'll kind of unrender, and uh, no taming will get done. So you do need to stay within his render distance. So do, working on your base or living here for about an in-game 24 hours, so not that long. I'm not entirely sure if sleeping helps. I haven't actually tried that myself. That could be something you could experiment with. Um, but yeah, all you, all, all you do is you come here and you just chuck in your meat. Okay, maybe not on the catwalk like that, but yeah, you just you just chuck in your raw meat, just like that, and they'll tame. He won't be eating it while I'm here, because if I can have a look at him, I don't think I can without falling in. He'll probably be frightened or angry at me, but I can just throw in all my meat, hang around this area, and he will be tamed in no time. So you can see over here, I've done a similar thing, this time with two wolves. The wood from the uh, collapsed thing is still there. These guys have tamed, or there was two of them, but one seems to have gotten out somehow. Not sure what's happened there. That's the first time I've ever seen any of them escape. But this guy here is tamed, and he's hungry. Now, if you wanted to get him out... Oh! Okay, so that's a wild one, and he's fallen in, and I could just hop out. So I guess that's another method <laughs> to getting them in the hole. Doesn't really matter how you do it, but I'm very lucky didn't get my head chomped just then. So if I had some more meat, which I don't, I just have cooked meat. The lox meat. Um, I could chuck that in. That's not really what I want. I want the uh, raw meat, but yeah, this is what you can do. If you have a bunch of wolves in here and you don't want them escaping or you don't want a giant hole in the ground, you can just go and gather some wood and then go ahead and you could build a roof over the top. Just so nothing falls in or so that you don't accidentally fall in, perhaps. There's another wolf right over there. Could maybe lure him in as well. Just pull out my hammer just in case. There we go. Easy. And it's that simple. You got these in here. They're not going to escape. You could put fences around here if you really wanted. Can't afford fences. I'll be one sec. So yeah, you could put fences around here if you were done using this pit. 
it's pretty much free to make another pit so you can make as many as you needed and yeah you can jump over this fence you can chuck some stuff in there i have a whole pack of wolves on me now Jeez. all right oh and now i've fallen in not something you want to do so i found myself in a predicament thankfully this table is protecting me gonna get some stam back i do have a stam potion Okay, so getting my stuff back was a bit of a pain, but I got more wolves in here than I was originally hoping for. So they did destroy the uh, the bench like I said they would, and they are stuck here. So worst case scenario, you could lead yourself in there to die and then just come and collect your stuff. You can always build platforms down and they can't jump on them, but you can. So it is that easy. I really do hope this guide helps you guys out because building pens for these things is tiring you have to do double layers you need a lot of wood and you have to worry about constantly repairing them this is an indestructible pen that you can keep filling up with wolves and it is super just a full inch as long as you don't fall in it's insanely easy and little worry at all of course when they're all tamed or however many are tamed that you were after you can just dig your way out i could kind of show you how to do that without killing myself again kind of dig down like that now if i dig any lower you see they'll be able to get out and then you can also flatten the land like level the ground it's not going to work now but when they're closer it'll smooth it out kind of like a ramp and you can always just build the land back up to fix it now i'm going to get away before this wolf over there <laughs> comes for me but there you have it guys that's my tips and tricks on how you can easily tame wolves without needing any what just happened with my game? But yeah, that's how you can tame wolves without any required materials. Of course, you'll need to be in the snow, so you'll want either this fur cloak, which you get later in the game when you're up to silver, so you would have beaten bone mass at that point. If you're stuck on bone mass or would like some tips and tricks for that boss, I have a way to cheese it without taking any damage. That'll be up on my channel roughly around the same time as this video, so go and check that out. Go tame some wolves. Let me know if it worked for you. I'd love to know how your experiences went. Subscribe for more content just like this. I got some pretty cool videos on the way. I hope to see you in one of those videos, but until then, take care, guys. I'll catch you later. Peace.